Hey, welcome to UK Wildgrass. In this video, I'll show you how you can identify hops, Cumulus lupulus, a native perennial climbing plant which you can find growing wild in woodland edges and hedgerows. First, let's take a quick look at the leaves. So they have either three or five deeply divided lobes. And they have toothed margins. And they're rough and papery to the touch. And they have an opposite leaf arrangement. So you'll see two growing opposite each other, coming from the same point along the vine. Traditionally the cone-shaped female flowers, like this, are used for flavouring ale. They've got a deep, bitter flavour which is used to counteract the sweetness of the grain. And you can also use them for making a nice relaxing cup of tea. Hops are dioecious, meaning they're either male or female. In the same way that nettles do, a plant will either have male or female flowers. And these female ones are the ones that are used. Hops generally flower from July onwards and are usually harvested in September. And if you pull apart the petals, you can see the lupulin glands inside there. And they contain the resin, which gives the, the nice bitter flavour. test whether they're ripe or not. First we'll look at the colour. If they're a light green with not much yellowing or discoloration, they're probably not ripe yet. Also if you squash them and they still feel a bit wet, then they're not ripe. As well as the, uh, the smell. If they smell a bit grassy rather than citrus, then give them a few more weeks. And also if you roll them in your fingers and they just kind of mush up like that. Yeah, that's when they're still unripe. However, if you look at these ones here, you see how they're not such a bright green and they've got discoloration at the tips. And if you crush them, they make like a papery sound and the, the petals come off easily like that and they're ready. Also if you check out the lupulin glands, they're a nice dark yellow and they've got a nice, nice citrus smell. These on the other hand, up here, are too far gone and when you crush them they'll have a smell of garlic and uh, yeah you don't really want those for flavouring ale. So just about this ripeness is perfect. Another part of the plant which is good to eat are the shoots in spring or early summer. We don't really have them here now because it's too late in the year. But the, the end growing tip like that it's a bit like asparagus. Just be aware if you're eating those to check the, the leaves because we do have other vines growing in the UK which are poisonous like bryony. So just make sure you learn the leaves of hop and of the other vines like bryony. <laughs> 